As a versatile cloud computing platform, Linode offers a wide array of features and services which can be custom tailored to meet your needs using our self-service cloud dashboard. Our offerings include shared and dedicated CPUs, as well as high memory configurations and even GPUs. In this video, we wanted to talk about dedicated CPUs and how they differ from our shared CPU plans. First, let's define our terms. A shared Linode plan shares physical CPU cores with other Linodes. That means that there may be other Linodes running alongside your instance, which could be taking up physical CPU cycles and delaying the execution of your Linode's tasks. Usually this delay is imperceptible for common cloud hosting workloads. That's why shared plans work so great for things like low traffic web applications, code repositories, database servers, virtual private networks, container clusters, or content delivery network nodes. However, this delay, called CPU steal, can negatively impact overall performance on more CPU intensive workloads. Things like development tool chains, code compilation, game servers, big data analysis, scientific computing or machine learning, or production level websites and applications. They will all benefit from the use of dedicated CPU cores. With a dedicated CPU plan, Physical CPU cores will be entirely dedicated to your Linode. No scheduling execution with other Linodes on the same hardware. This means whatever task you assign to your Linode will run at peak speed and efficiency. So let's examine some of these workloads and see if you would benefit from a dedicated CPU plan. Continuous integration and continuous delivery are software tool chains intended to reduce the overall workload on developers by automatically testing code commits and other small changes over time. This can automatically catch regressions, code conflicts and other bugs from creeping into code bases. In most cases, CI and CD servers can become quite resource intensive, especially as the number of automated tests and builds scale. When a CI or CD server is expected to be active continuously, even only during business hours, a dedicated CPU will offer more speed and reliability for your deployment. Game servers. While there are a few game servers which could be run using shared hosting plans, many game servers will suffer with lag, stuttering issues, and delays in data streaming. Titles like Minecraft, Valheim, Team Fortress, Ark Survival Evolved, Rust, and Counter-Strike Global Offensive are prime examples of servers that need unfettered access to the underlying CPU and would benefit from a dedicated CPU environment. Audio and Video now, audio and video codecs are notorious for the amount of time it takes to re-encode data from one format to another. If your server will be taking source files and converting them into other formats, we suggest a dedicated CPU plan. Or if you're doing large video files, a dedicated GPU plan might be more your speed. Big data and analysis. Are you working with big data? A good way to tell is by looking at the three Vs. The first V is volume. If your data set spans terabytes, petabytes, exabytes, or more, then you're treading in big data territory. Velocity. Typically with big data, things are being created, read, updated, and destroyed at extremely high speed. Variety. When talking about big data, it's important to consider the variety of information and data formats. For example, you could be storing documents, audio, video, photos, and more, all in the same database. Big data means collecting and categorizing all of this. If any of this sounds like your use case, dedicated CPU plans allow you to devote the appropriate resources for big data tasks. Scientific computing. Scientific computing has quickly become regarded as the third pillar of scientific discovery behind theoretical analysis and experimentation. Scientific computing can be used to investigate complex scientific issues that would be impossible, impractical, or too dangerous to perform in a lab or other controlled environment. Machine learning. Today, machine learning has become all the rage and AI seems to be everywhere. With a Linode dedicated CPU plan, you can train up a machine learning based prediction algorithm to add a suggestion feature to your website, online shop, audio or video hosting site or search engine. Tools like TensorFlow and PyTorch all benefit from the additional resources provided by a dedicated CPU plan. Production business uses. It's more vital than ever to have a website that loads quickly and efficiently to capture prospective customers, especially if your product or service catches on with the buying public and your website experiences serious traffic. Doing all that you can to be ready for such an influx to your web properties is just one reason why using a dedicated CPU instance is a good idea for production use cases. So what do you think? Does your use case meet the criteria for a Linode dedicated CPU plan? Use the link below to get $100 in free credit to get you started and check out the documentation for more info on how to spin up your own dedicated CPU. Did we miss a common use case? Let us know in the comments. We'd love to hear from you.